How's it going there guys? My name's Matt, this is my brother Baba, and welcome to the brand new series, The Mortal Beast. The series where me and Baba have to fight for our place to play in the final against one of you guys, a subscriber. Yes, we both have one Mortal Beast to earn our team new players. At the end of every game, we will compare our Beast player ratings. Whoever gets the best rating on the day will earn a new player for their team, worth up to 100k coins. The loser will get nothing. And game 10 will be the semi-final where me and Baba have to win the game and score as many goals as we can and the person who scores the most goals will progress into the finale one of us will be doing a forfeit you need to pick a team we have just taken things to a whole new level so then lads this is it episode seven we are yes. to episode seven of Ep mortal beast episode seven three episodes to go until we play one of you guys but before we do this episode if you want to buy or sell ultimate team cards make sure to check out fifautonline.com description down below for a very trustworthy and reliable service okay and i'm just going to quickly set target guys move on move your hand mate <coughs> now this is my chair today mate go on then move mate. yours i'll just yes the target today guys i'm going to go four quick what we going two thousand likes in two hours let's oh, nail it that's quite a big one mate let's do it let's we need do a lot of speed on this one then guys oh, that's a cracking in two hours Cavani. so then yes we open up here with what Cavani what were you saying about goal. Cavani I was giving Cavani some stick wasn't I he smashed it mate <laughs> well it's typical isn't it whenever, it you, is whenever you say something ah what ah whenever ah. you whenever you say something Jesus um, the complete opposite then happens that's a general rule in life you slag a player off he comes out next game and he performs, and that's what happened with Cavani. We're not done yet with Beastie Goals here. Check this out from De Rossi. What? what the <laughs> what's going on? It's not funny, man. That's the. <laughs> it's... Jesus. I don't know what you're laughing at. Both your CDMs have just scored absolutely insane yeah. goals. I know, mate. What is going on? I know, in the mate. same game. Yeah. Fantastic. So, seriously, guys, Fantastic. two great goals there. Very pleased in this game because I always like to offer uh, fresh gameplay. That's, that's what I. Ah, he got you there, mate. He that was there. that wasn't so fresh. That was actually crap defending nah, from me. I really, give you that not though. Good enough defending. When people are dilly dallying on the edge of the box, yeah, it, it can be so hard, hard to defend. Yeah, but yeah, I mean, defending the last few games has been poor. I'm not going to lie, guys. It's, mm. it's been it's been pathetic. It's not good enough for me. Shoddy. Okay, I need to get better in these games. Defending is not good enough. Mm. Get the ball here with Cavani crosses it in. Now nice. Jelly with the goal. Nice. That's only going to bump up our rating to potentially beat Matthew today to get a new player. Uh, and now check good. this out, guys. What a tackle! Oh, brilliant tackle. No, it's not. Red card. Oh, get off, mate. Red. Yeah. Wow. That wasn't That's red. Ridiculous. Look how big he is. He's massive, isn't he? Okay. <laughs> That's why he scores all my corner goals. Hang He's on, massive. let's check this out. That is a great sorry, tackle. That's a great That's tackle. That's a great tackle. I got the ball. I got the Saved ball. It anyway, this is what you're moaning about. What's the line in the FIFA song? I forgot. He got the ball, refs giving a pen. pen. I'm down two ten men. Quite literally, you see. Tramps you. Yeah, he tramped me because the red card just left big gaps, so we gave away three really <laughs> bad goals. And the red, and card, red card really, really shat That's on me there. Shame. It's a shame. It is a shame, mate, but I get on with it. I picked myself up. What's important is today we won the game. We did that. We scored some good goals. Mm -hmm. Okay, we let yeah, three goals in. Yeah, cracking goals in that app. Cracking. Inform Hamsick or Inform Inlet in the uh, CDM, CDM position. position. Yes. That's what I'm looking at today, guys. Now, Inlet is probably the better defensive yes. option. Yeah. I think Hamsick does like to get up and attack. I'm sick, we'll wonder. I think he's got mm. a high attacking work rate, yeah, so he's going to no, wander, mate. Depends correct me if I'm wrong, want. but I think Inla's got a medium work rate. So, However, I think Vidal's got a high attacking work rate. Correct right. me if I'm wrong, guys, but I think he does. So, I mean, right. you know, it is whatever you want. It's yeah, you I mean, want. I am favouring the defensive option here, guys, because I've left a lot of gaps recently. So then, guys, if you could leave a dash babber and help me out in those comments. So, the half-time break where we talk real football. And, guys, who would you prefer in real life, in your team? Would you prefer Robin Van Persie or Aguero? Leave a comment right now. Let's get the discussion going. So then, guys, match day seven for Team Matt. Let's get this one off and underway. Here are my two players on the screen right now. Uh, should I get Bale or Azar if Luis Suarez gets the better match rating today? Which is not going to be an easy job because Balotelli has banged in a few and, you know, it's Foot looking you. like it's going to be a good match rating. Thought you were going to say Baba then. But we'll Deceiving. see. Deceiving. Deceiving. But we'll see how this one goes. Now we do fill the spot there with Navas to taking replacement for Valencia. Kind of a little bit sad to see Valencia go because he's been putting his work in for this team and he's been supporting the team great. Not the most attacking player. Not the most, you know, 
going forward player, but he is fantastic at delivering and dispatching those deadly balls and just supporting the team generally. So here's my first opponent, the 3-4-3 formation. And at the start of this game, I was building up some nice composure, some nice play, some nice passing. And here you can see mm. a nice counter-attacking goal here. And it's just pass, pass, pass composure, basically. In fact, in fact guys, I just want to... Right, okay, I like to give out tips now and again to, uh -huh. you know, help people improve with yes. FIFA. Uh, a lot of people have said that our tips have helped them very well. That's, well, that's great so, to hear, guys. You yeah, know, if, if, if our tips can help you as a player, that's yeah. fantastic to yeah. hear because, you know... Um, we're, we're all here to help. Each yes. Other. Now then, what? yeah, what I was going to say anyway is, okay, this is quite a general point, but passing mm. the ball. Now, one tip I'd say with passing the ball is be very, very calm and composed. A lot of people I play yeah. on FIFA, yeah. they play quite, in fact, you do it a lot, sort yeah. of panicky. Yes. And what I mean by that yes. is they feel they need to pass, they the, ball to pass the ball as soon yeah. as they receive it. I agree with um, you. It's like, I call it panic passing. Yeah. So, so it's like, you know, you, you Panic a little bit. Oh, I, I completely oh, agree with you. It's, it's like panicking. don't be afraid to hold on yeah, to the just ball. Be just calm, just a little bit. Just hold on to the ball and look for a better pass. Yeah, and in fact, with, with one player, you can make so much space. Um, and what I mean again is keep the ball. You might change direction. Yeah. Um, make a little bit of a run, make yeah. some space, and then yeah. that opens up new options. So, so the point is do not panic. Yeah, I mean, it would be great, you know, to get your midfielders to have quite a high sort of dribbling rate so you can mm. turn with the ball and hold the ball a little bit longer to look for those dispatches and those passes you know I, yeah. I, yeah I agree with you on that one that's I, one of my biggest uh, and also points for, if you're passing too much too fast the first yeah. touch will eventually catch up with you and just you know throw everything out of the water so then guys who should I get in my episode let's find out who got the better match rating right now let's go so then, today we got 8.9 with Balotelli, a good performance from Balotelli, and I'm looking at Inform Hamsik or Inform Inle. If you could leave a comment and a dash baba, that would be fantastic. Yeah, after watching that Balotelli performance, you know, it was going to be hard to beat that, but Suarez picks up a 7.2, so I will be getting nothing, guys. And But for the next episode, I will be looking for those centre midfielders in the Barclays Premier League. So look, get your comments in right now, guys. I want to see the comments filled with beast centre midfielders in the BPL right now. Yep, and remember guys, hit that target. Let's we set do it. a target. 2,000 likes in two hours. Yep. Let's nail it. Let's go, go, go. And now let's do the jump certification. Now I've got no we never fail to meet targets on this channel. Okay. Okay. Marius Kielhofer, jump certified. Jump certified, Dre jump. Keep it all. Keep it up, guys. If you want to be jump certified, leave a like and a comment right now. And you might be picked for the next episode. It's worth a shot. Give it a go. We'll say yes tomorrow, chaps. See you later. He's 1 0 up. I've outplayed this guy, but the stats say I'm in control. I've had 20.